Good morning. We're back in No Place Like Home, and we had a little bit of a setback. So, I've been playing the hard mode, but I've been playing it in the closed beta version. And it got updated to the new version, but as a result, I lost all the progress. So, I have spent the last few days trying to get caught up. And I have mostly, there's still some underground stuff I haven't done yet. A couple of things I probably missed. But for the most part, I got caught up to where I was before I lost all the progress. We'll work on chickens and stuff at another time. We have food ready to pick. I will grab these seeds. So we're working on restocking our seeds. There. A couple of things I did notice from having to go through this again. One, they seem to have finally decreased the number of plots of land that drop. So, thank you for that. Still have plenty to grow with and plenty of room to put down more, but I'm not getting a bazillion <laughs> plant plots. Two, I noticed that they added the ability to recycle batteries. And I've already recycled two stacks and you'll be happy to know that they actually provide a lot of recycled material. In fact, I believe they provide 120 recycled material per stack. So that's pretty good. Here's our upgrades that we have so far. Drill. We have the rubble drill. We have the berry picker gloves, which adds a chance of producing twice the yield with crops. Hardened drill. Bigger water tank. Trash extractor, which gives adds a chance at double resource drops. Runner shoes. Herbal vitamins, which expands the health bar, and a bigger backpack. Alright, let's go out. Something else I also learned, and I had totally forgotten, is that you can actually swing your drill at enemies and kill them so <laughs> yay for that that's done i so said i've gotten a good portion of this done but not all of it that i had done And let's open from the other side. All right. We did free Napoleon the pig, and we've done most of the quests that we had done already. Go up here. Can't remember where that goes out at. Guess we're going to find out. I hear water running. I think I know where that is now. Yep. See if Mr. Mark has anything new I can buy. I have the beehive. I have the upgraded beehive, which I need rubber for. I have the pigsty. I have the mayo maker. I have the jam house, which I can't build without the rubber again. 
I do not have a, a well recipe yet, but I need jam for that. And I don't need to buy the plant pot plots yet. Our little foxes over here are very happy. If they're happy enough to give me five <laughs> strawberry seeds apiece. is good because I only have one birdhouse right now so if I can get seeds any other way then I'm very happy for that and they make the cutest noises don't they Obviously, we still don't have the glass drill, so we can't get there. And that's actually a pretty good barrier to lead you away from going to Frozen Peaks too soon. But as you've noticed, I have planted apples everywhere. Might as well grab these. They're a good source of pet food. And we just got a whole ton of them. I think I've cleared this. Yeah, because this was the area over there was where I found Napoleon. And we have, okay. We had some baddies over here. We had baddie go baddie. We have the electric spider crabs, which I kind of like. Oh, that's a lot faster. Like I said, I totally forgot that was a thing. That makes killing everything a lot easier. Of course, it helps if I uh, actually get close enough to hit them. See, how much space do I have? Okay, I got plenty of space. Although at some point I'm going to have to upgrade the bag again. Let's see what's on the other side. I got a couple mobs right off the bat. Alright, let's clean this up first. All 
right, where are you? Oh, the button right in front of my face. Now, the one thing I have noticed that the vacuum feels a little wimpier. And maybe that's intentional for hard mode. So that the upgrade is actually important. When do we go first? Let's see what we have over here. All right, come on, you. You coming? You coming? There. Oh, got a call. Oh, I remember those two. I don't remember where I am now. Grief. Forgot how much of a mess this place is. Yep, I remember this spot because you had the big spire, uh, big ants here, and then it had the big ants over there. Like I said, we haven't had a chance to get through all of this yet. Just vacuum up some of this stuff here. Then I think we're going to go back out. I will come back and work on this some more later. Since I know where I'm at now. I do want to get what I've just done cleared out. Come on. Vacuum. Well, I got all this already. Oh, good grief. I just realized the time. Yeah, I've got a lot here to explore still. I love how they set reset them to a nice, neat little row. Those were fun to play with. I think it's here, Peg. Yes, I did. Sorry, Piggy. You're going to have to wait. I don't have any... I don't have a space for you yet. We have not found... 
like the fast door between the farm and Lonely Hills, not Lonely Hills. You know, I don't even know what the first zone is called. The village, I think. And I did say I planted tons of apple trees. There's pretty much apple trees everywhere. I also have six peach trees so far. I'm finding the uh, fruit trees a lot more useful too. Doesn't make a ton of pet food, but it makes some. There we go. What do you have? Oh, just some rubble. Okay. Let's put down these. Thank you for getting out of the way. All right. So, yeah. A couple of little changes that I was really glad to take note of. Even though it did mean resetting all my progress to do it. And of course, we know about the you'll uh, was it? Um, I believe if you die, you lose jars and materials. So let's try not to do that. Drill upgrade rubber waste. Ah, that's what's holding me back. It takes a lot of jars to get it. So we're working on getting a few more jars. That takes corn, that takes carrots, that takes oranges. None of which we have. Runner's shoes take jam. And of course, our peach trees are next to Rudy because he's such a peach. Ah, I will grab that. Never turn down the free wood. Even if you're going to turn down everything else. Well, that gave me a few more of those prepared meals. Don't turn down the honey either, especially if you only have one beehive. I don't know why it is, but occasionally I get a little bit of lag, especially when I'm first in between zones. I love boxes. No, I'm not coming by for the seeds today. Okay. 
I should be gathering the eggs and the truffles and stuff, but well, we do have other places to explore. Oh, hello. Goodbye. And of course, we have to find the button to unlock that, which is a further in here. Oh, it's right here. All right, let's go back and clean that spot up. That's right, we're still working on this. The trees. Oh, how, how some of the <laughs> stuff clips into the walls and You'll be vacuuming and be like, oh, look, it, it's stuck in the wall. I'm assuming since we've done this, you, we can now put that in the recycler. All right. All right, come on. Come on. Now. We have two spider crabs. Let's see if I can stun them both. Yes. They're easy to deal with if you stun them both at the same time. And then you can take the first one down. And the second one usually does not get a chance to move off before you can stun it too. Usually. Doesn't mean that works 100% of the time. Where? Oak seeds. Notice I was getting some oak seeds. Can't remember.
remember if it's oat or wheat seeds I need it for the apple pie. I would think it would be the wheat. Oat seeds are more for crumbles. Another electric spider crab up there. See another ant over there. And of course, now he's over here. Oh no, he's not. That was another ant. Okay. What do we have here? We have a chest that's half buried in the ground. Not exactly the best chest in the world either, was it? So, Not being very helpful, is it? Where'd y'all go? Not the most intelligent robots ever. <laughs> Where'd that come from? That must have been left behind from the spider crab. Which is something I have noticed that if they shoot their little, uh, I don't know, is it the poison or what? But it can actually stay inside the rubble and still cause damage long after you've killed the spider crab. Recipe for cart with roses. Okay. I'll have to make one of those. I like them. They're pretty. Something else I've noticed is that the cost of making the decorations is very cheap. I think I think it's always been that way. And it takes like one recycled material to make 
a decoration. Probably because decorating isn't like the main focus of the game. So it's kind of like, okay, the main focus of the game is cleaning up and finding your grandpa. So we're not going to charge you an arm and a leg for the decorations. Which some games would actually still charge you an arm and leg for the decorations. A big giant robot over there. I think that's the same one we saw from up the hill. I keep forgetting how big the first zone is. We've gone through an awful lot and we still have some ways to go. I think it was all, not until we got to the desert that it's, the zone started feeling a little cramped. Almost a little rushed, which may have been the case. They may have been under a time constraint at that point. Almost that time again. Now, if I'm right, I'm supposed to be able to fast travel to her grandpa's farm. via the map and I want to test that okay, here's the map I am at the village aren't I I guess not Okay. Well, it gets me close to her house. And you a little what are in the way. Oh. Oh, thank you. There we go. We got all sorts of seeds from that. And I want to test this out. So can I put this in the recycler? Yes, I can. Okay, so we can recycle old quest items now. Also good to know. Now, as for how much I'm going to get from recycling it, I don't know. Guess we'll find out in the morning. We'll check that out real quick. So 
So yeah, a couple little upgrades I didn't realize had happened. And um, actually very appreciated. Very much appreciating them. I mean, like I said, the big one is not getting overloaded with the plots of dirt. So how many? Four. Okay, so you're not going to get a lot of recycled parts out of them. But the fact is you can recycle them. Let's go ahead and gather up all these crops. You, little robot, make yourself useful. Gather the crops for me. I kind of wish I could program him to do that. I mean, they're cute little guys, and they're definitely more useful than the llamas for the most part. But, uh, still kind of wish we could, like, I mean, she, she's a Mars girl. You would think she could do something like that. And I am running out of space in this chest. Okay, what can we do? Hmm. I'm just going to shove them right here. Lettuce. That was the other one. Probably won't get a ton of preserved food out of that, but we'll get something. And of course, now the plots are ready to be replanted again. And we have seeds to plant. So, yay. <laughs> yeah. I think we're going to make this one short. And next time we'll see how much further I've gotten. If I've been able to get any more upgrades. And we'll go exploring some more. But until then, bye for now.